Hey, everybody. I'm Jazz. And I'm Tyler. And so I was tired, and so I was like, I'm going to reach for Mountain Dew. Stay awake. And then I was like, you know what? What's better than one Mountain Dew? Four giant cans of Mountain Dew. And funky colors and flavors. Yeah, so let's move these over here. Let's see. We got raspberry lemonade with spiked with prickly pear cactus juice. We've got Mountain Dew Green Label, crafted with green apple kiwi. Mm -hmm. Sounds kind of gross. We got here. We got another spiked lemonade with prickly pear cactus juice. Wait, how is that different from the other one? Then? That one's raspberry. Also, oh, we've got raspberry and then regular old lemonade. And then what's this white label? Yeah, so it's crafted with tropical citrus. And I'm not going to comment on the fact we have white label and not black label. Oh, I drank black label last night, and so is everyone else. Okay. All right. That's fair. Tropical citrus. So, uh, which of these fine flavors would you like to try first? Uh, let's do the spiked one. All right. Spiked lemonade. Mm-hmm. Lemonade flavor Mountain Dew. Concentrate and add their natural flavors. Make sure to open it right into the microphone. Oh, yeah. For optimal, terrible sound. <laughs> you sure about that? Yeah. Yeah. I'll just add in the Nintendo Switch noise, it'll be fine. Oh, yeah. Oh, crack open a cold one. All right, bro. All right. Thanks, bro. Well, how surprising. It's a whitish yellow. Almost like lemonade. Mm-hmm. All right, dink it. All right. I mean, I'm not gonna lie, it just tastes like lemonade. Bubbly lemonade. Yeah, kind of carbonated bubbly lemonade. Yeah, I had had this one at the Taco Bell. Yeah, I also had it there. And it was kind of shit, but I think it's just our Taco Bell. Yeah, but I think it was better at the can. Mm -hmm. It was more refreshing. Mm -hmm. I don't think any of these actually have juice in them though. Uh, Five percent or less, probably. Lemon juice, concentrate. <laughs> Contains 2% two two juice. 2% two lemon juice? Mm-hmm. Okay. You, so. All right, how about, how about we go yellow, green, white, red? Okay. That's kind of how colors work, right? I, I guess. It's kind of a spectrum. Mm. Oh, yeah. It's going to be absolutely hell. This one has... It's the green apple kiwi. Mm-hmm. Now, this one doesn't say anything about juice. <laughs> Oh, and green apple juice concentrate. That's after sugar. White grape on this one. Okay. Caffeine's pretty low down, actually. Mm-hmm. All right. So I'm gonna... I love how it says low sodium, but it's 70 milligrams. Well. Meh. It's plastic table compares. This is a very interesting color. I love the color. Yeah. It's like the kryptonite green. Look at that. Right up against the green screen. Yeah. You can't even see it. Think. And you have a green shirt on too. Ooh, that's good. Okay, I like that one with the lemonade actually. I do too. Yeah. That is good. It is very green apple-y. Mm-hmm. No, not much kiwi. No, I don't really taste any kiwi at all in there. Mm -hmm. But definitely has notes of strong apple. Oh yeah, that was good. I mean, Mountain Dew doesn't really do subtle, you know. No. If they have a flavor, they're gonna throw as much of that flavor in there as possible, and it's gonna be all Mountain Dewy. You know? Mm-hmm. Because that one was good. So far, that's the best. Yeah. Of two, that is the best. Well, yeah. Still. Yeah. Establishing. Now the purists are gonna say that we're gonna have a little bit of cross contamination using the same cups, but I'm really not that worried. It's Mountain Dew. Mm-hmm. And eat a dick. Yeah. 44. <clears throat> All right, fantastic. White label. This is less yellow than the lemonade, but it kind of looks like the lemonade. Mm-hmm. And I'm gonna... Ooh, not sure I feel about that smell. Mm. Mm. This is the white grape juice? Yeah, white grape juice. Mm. It's tropical citrus. Um... You can get more. We don't need to fill up on it. Um, hmm. So, A, I can't really tell if it's good. I'm gonna get a little more. B, I couldn't really detect much in the in the grape variety as far it's as like white you know. grape, which is different. Well, I know white grape is different, but it should be a little grapey still. I don't like that word. I'm never gonna use that again. 
No, I don't think you should have your green nugget. <clears throat> you know, it's just really plain. Ow. Ow. <laughs> Sorry, there was a cat trying to eat my fat, uh, my foot. <laughs> your fat foot? My fat foot. With a pH. Like I said, I'm tired. Mm -hmm. But this Mountain Dew is gonna help. Mm -hmm. it, All right. It's really bland. Yeah, it's super bland. I'm. So let's read the ingredients on this. Mm -hmm. Because, I mean, it's, they're all the same thing. The carbonated water, then sugar, and then a concentrate of whatever's the special ingredient in them. Mm -hmm. And then other stuff, sodium, blah, 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 blah. Kiwi flavor is like the seventh item on this one. Yeah, it's very, very light on the green label with the kiwi. Mm -hmm. Yeah. All right. All right, well, we have the raspberry lemonade. <clears throat> so still green number one? Um, yeah, probably. Let me finish it. Two. Ooh. It's more pink than I expected. Mm -hmm. You know, if you put these in a glass by themselves mm -hmm. and didn't tell people they were Mountain Dew, they might seem like fancier drinks. This is true. Yeah, so maybe at like a fancy party, you'd be like, everybody's drinking the mimosas, and I'm like, oh yes, I've got my uh, raspberry lemonade. Mm -hmm. It's very classy. Whoa! Whoa. Indeed. That's packed with flavor. <laughs> yeah. Um, so it's not bad per se. No, no. But it has more intense of a flavor than I expected. Yeah. Because it should just be like raspberry lemonade. It should, no. should be a slightly more raspberry version of the spike lemonade. No. <laughs> it does not smell good. <clears throat> Um, uh... No. Yeah, I might have to say no on that. Yeah. That's kind of nasty. Yeah. It's kind of like... I've been, I've been drinking those different, like, Pepsi 1893s. Which, I like the blue one. The blue one's okay. The current? Mm-hmm. Yeah, it's it's drinkable, I would say. Yeah. But I was not a fan. The grapefruit I thought was really bad. I like the grapefruit. I think almost everything with fake grapefruit taste in it is going to be pretty bad. But I like Fresco a lot, so... Yeah. It's kind of... That one is described as, like, a... More bitter Fresco. Mm hmm That's how I describe that one. But that... It's a bit of a strange taste. I'm not it, gonna lie. Yeah. It does not taste like raspberry lemonade. It no. tastes like... <laughs> yeah. Our, our, our resident expert off-screen is, uh... Dying. Yeah, it's another thing. I like that you moved all of the cans <laughs> off of the screen. Sorry. Okay, well... Those are the two bad ones. Okay, well we're going to do our thing where we, from left to right, we're going to pick what our favorite is. Okay, so I'm going to put this one over here. That's number one, green. Yeah. Green label. Green. Let's take it out. Okay. Yeah, green label. All right, and then raspberry lemonade? No. No? Uh, no. I'm going to say the regular one. Regular right? lemonade, and then the white label, even though it had no taste? It was, it's bland as can be. Bland and no taste is better than really funky taste, I yeah. guess? Uh, yeah. All right. Yeah, so At these, least the, to me. These, I think, are our fancy little guys here. Mm-hmm. Yeah, so... Number one. Number two, number three, number four. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, okay. I'm not still not sure about that raspberry lemonade. I did not expect it to be so weird. Mm -hmm. Yeah, because I expected it, the, the regular lemonade to be weird, too, because of the pear. Did, the prickled pear. Uh, the prickly pear cons. Cactus juice. Yeah. Okay, well, now that I know there's cactus juice in it, it makes I it read awesome. that! Oh. You no. don't read. <laughs> oh. It's like agave, sort of, yeah. <laughs> it does have kind of an agave flavor to it, now that I think about it, because that's basically like... Tequila? Well, no, it's what no, goes in. No, it tastes better. Mm. Mm, yeah. Ooh, here's a good idea. Bring bring that glass over here. Oh, shit. Let's mix them all together. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Obviously, that's what we gotta do. That's what we gotta do. So we can make a nice base of this pink stuff. Oh, shit. And then nice white situation. With this stuff. Mm -hmm. Ooh, now it's like a light pink. Let's show the process so far. Alright, and then a little bit of yellow. Okay, now we've got like a rosé. Yeah, it's kind of brown. Mm. Orange. It's like an... Actually, it's kind of a nice color. Yeah, it I is. Kind of, I kind of like this. Yeah, it's, it's like a rosé. It's sort of an orangish, orangish pink. And then we're going like to ruin it. And then we're going to green it up. Green it up. Well, 
And now it just turned into Mountain Dew. <laughs> <laughs> so that's what happens when you mix a bunch of Mountain Dew. A little Mountain more, Dew. a little more green. Okay. There you go. All right. It's... All right, bro. Make sure to swish it around so that it gets mixed up. Where's our swizzle sticks? Mmm. We don't need to swizzle. Oh boy. boy. Oh boy. Oh, that is a that is an interesting smell. Ooh, that smell. Yeah. <laughs> we can't sing any more of that. Okay. <laughs> I actually really like that smell. It's an interesting smell. We gotta dig it before it's, we sing it's, it. It smells like Mountain Dew. <laughs> Stealing that from Rhett and Link. All right. That's better than the raspberry lemonade. Yeah, it is. But still not all that great. It's not a not a bad concoction. No. Yeah. Oh god, the aftertaste. Oh, aftertaste is a raspberry. Little weird. Yeah. I tried to, we tried to cover up your raspberry with the green label. Oh. But it didn't really help. Mm -hmm. All right. How would you describe the flavor? Confusing. Yeah, that's the thing. Whenever you mix a bunch of stuff together and you drink it, there's no interesting thing you can say because it just tastes like a confused mess in your mouth. Mm -hmm. With an aftertaste of the raspberry. <clears throat> not oh. Yeah, which is the name of my first porno movie, available now on porn.com. Which is a real site. Oh, okay, I mean... <laughs> so is sex.com, <laughs> and, and sex.biz, and, and sex.pizza. And fandiction.pizza. Well, we got fandiction.pizza? I'm working on it. All right. Okay. We could go at the dot .org, or for $40 more, we could get the dot .pizza. <laughs> but that's neither here nor there. I need to down this, because I need to be a man. Mm-hmm. Chug it. I'll tell you what. It tasted better than that Italian caramel soda I had at lunch today. Uh. Yes. And that's saying something. It tasted like paint varnish. Ugh. Really, really sweet paint varnish. I'm awake now. <laughs> Okay, that did the job. I'm awake. I have all of the awakeness inside of me. Okay, we're gonna go now and um, <clears throat> tell us what you think about the various Mountain Dew label, label special thingies yeah. in the comments. What do you think about this whole trend of creating specialty versions of regular sodas? I think if they're embracing the uh, like the Taco Bell idea of like let's make a shit ton of like specialty items but never keep them around. Right. Because they've had, like, game fuel versions of Mountain Dew. That's true. And they never, they, they're almost always the same, but they never stay for very long. Yeah, they come back once in a while, but... It, it's always tied to a different video game, because I remember there was the Warcraft one, the Halo 2 one, the Call of Duty one. Yeah, I remember it started out with, like, Halo and early Call of Duty, and now it's, like, Destiny and... Yeah. It was all, and, but for a while it wasn't really tied in with the game, like... They are now with promotional codes. Yeah. I guess every time a game that's kind of like really mainstream. Game. Yeah. Right. Then really mainstream. Mm -hmm. Your Call of Duty War as Gun. I think they're going back to World War II from the newest one. Mm -hmm. Well, people will probably still complain. Yeah. Mm. I like the World War II ones. Yeah, I, I enjoyed those. All right, what do you think, Kat? She says... Absolutely nothing, because yeah. he's an animal. All right. All right. So we tried these. We ranked them. We tried them together. They were weird. And now we're awake. Yeah. And I hope you are, too. I love you. With all of my heart. And Tyler, you know, he thinks you're cool. Yeah, you're cool. He wants to, wants to take his time with you. Mm-hmm. But each and every one of you are, are important to us and our all, souls. All, what are we at now, 50? Uh, 54, I think. Woo, 54 of you. Yeah. <laughs> But I mean, people who aren't subscribed to us will probably watch this too, and we love you too. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. We're just gonna keep going. And going. Bye. Subscribe. Also like and comment and whatever else you want to do. <laughs> Perfect. I don't know how to outro. <laughs> None of us know how to outro. Post record again. It's like saying goodbye on the phone.